our server dot js file is ready so we will start importing the uh, things we need first is the express so type cons express okay next thing is using the dot env so i just import it directly start env config you can use it uh, store it as const and then also uh, use it no issue now i will be creating a dot env file this is uh, for storing environment variables so that you don't use it directly in your files i will be using port 8080 for the server go to the server.js file first create a express app creating an express app so we create it like this okay now this app can be used uh, to host your application on the server so i will give app listen on the port 8080 so how to get that environment variable is process dot env dot port okay save it now uh, i want to check the server is uh, running we don't see any error here now i want to check whether the application is running fine or not so on a root i uh, like a route i will be checking um, by giving some values now i want to check whether my application is running correctly or not so i will write a simple api just to check it so for in order uh, for the application to use the json i will be using this express dot json okay and create an api a get api create a get api request and response okay what should it result res dot send i will be sending a json data message as hello abhavya okay okay done let's check so go to your browser i will see the port is localhost 8080 i will just enter it gives hello abhavya and it is coming from the code let's check once again i will make it as high and refresh the page and it comes as hi abhavya so our simple connection for the server is done our server is running and is also sending the response on the this route okay now the next step is connecting to our mongo so for this purpose i will be following the official documentation okay so always use the official documentation for any of the applications you are working on so we also need mongoose so let's install it first of all i will just open another and give this command okay it was a dollar sign here it will install mongoose then what we have is connecting so this is done uh, you can use mongo atlas so if you go to mongo atlas okay you can go sign in and create your account here i already have an account on this one so i will not be creating the account if you want me to show how this account is created and everything there just uh, post it in the comment section i will create a separate video on how to create the mongo db atlas account meanwhile i will be using my own account for the uh, for this application